Jeez, I don't know if I even use this. Let's check it out. I'm in my closet. <laughs> Hi guys, what's up? My name is Dee from Dee Lovey Life. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome. Another episode of Decluttering with Friends brought to you by a series of the Minimalism Game hosted by Michelle from My Everyday Wife Life and my fellow YouTuber friends. Make sure you check out the link down below in my description box as well as their channels. So this is actually week three. It is in the evening. I am a full-time caregiver and my day just ended here at 8 o'clock p.m. My mom, Queen G, who I take good care of. She is downstairs watching some TV before we start our bedtime routine. So I thought I would take a good, I don't know, 20 minutes up here in my closet to find 15 things to declutter. Everybody has their different styles or different techniques. Same thing goes with decluttering. If you're a beginner or you're, I don't know, if you're really lucky in advance or even a expert, which I am not. You know, this is not my first time in this rodeo <laughs> decluttering. I've done 30 bags in 30 days with Sophia at My Great Challenge, as well as Michelle at My Everyday Wife Live. I also did, I think it was a 30 day decluttering challenge with friends. And that was with Darlene, A Peek Inside, and Michelle again at My Everyday Wife Life. I'll link those playlists down below. You would think <laughs> that this time around would be just a snap you know like i don't have that much to declutter and eh, wrong there's always something to declutter so let's start i'm gonna go through my shoes there are some shoes that i know i just do not choose to wear for instance these look they're even they're breaking <laughs> I've kept them the last couple of times. Since then, the two times that I try to wear it, look, it started breaking off. I think it's just because I've had it too long. Why am I keeping them? Toss. I'm also going to get rid of these. I just do not wear them. They're in great condition. Look at that. I barely even wore these. These were so expensive when I first purchased them. I am going to try to sell them online, but I'm going to give myself maybe a week or two weeks and that's it. And then they're, they're gone. Let's see, I don't know why I'm keeping the old pair. I bought a new pair. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these too. I mean, come on, D, you can buy new ones. These I actually like and they're comfortable. So I'm going to keep those. These I really like. They're very comfy. I'm going to keep those. I like those. I'm going to keep those. Yeah, I think it's safe to get rid of these too. I have a really bad habit of holding on to shoe boxes, so I'm also going to get rid of this. Another shoe box. I mean, why am I holding on to these? Yeah, I can get rid of that too. Here's another random box I've been keeping, so that can also go as well. I'm also going to get rid of this hat. I don't really reach for it at all. A duplicate hat that I don't wear as well, so I'm gonna add that. I placed all of my little like makeup and toiletry bags in this one bag. That leaves me with uh, this one I don't want. This, that's what I had it for. I don't really use it. And why am I holding on to this bag? So three more items. I don't wanna keep that, that, I'm not too sure. Okay, I don't really grab this anymore either, so I'm gonna go ahead and toss that to the pile. And this is a Lancome cute little makeup bag, but I don't need it. Alrighty, here is 15 items for day 15. Boom! I got my bag of all my little tiny little bags in there. So that looks much better.
Here are my 16 items from the closet, an old tote bag. <laughs> these um, scarves. I don't think my mom's going to miss. She doesn't even ask for those anymore. Two puzzles here. Two games there. A little card game tripod that doesn't work very well. A hat that my mom just does not want to wear. <laughs> and slippers that just do not fit her. Another little puzzle that she used to do. Um, this clip that I always thought, oh, let me just hang on to it. I use this for her... Um, physical therapy kind of like a game as well as another puzzle that she's just pretty much done with so here is my 16 items for day 16 okay this is last year's calendar i can probably get rid of that i get rid of this one too let's see so i gotta yeah let's see what i can find to get off of this calendar for February and hubby's work schedule for this year. Yay! That's it. That's all that's on here. Okay, that one is clear. Oh, look. All that stuff again. Let's see if I can clear that out. <laughs> okay, yeah. If any of you have been on blood thinners, come it in. Yeah, it's a long story story but these are certain things that i was supposed to avoid while taking coumadin i'm fine so i don't need that that was like 2010 are you ready are you ready february 2000 <laughs> getting ready for an earthquake before i didn't even know this was even in here how funny well this is good information but i'm sure there's something that can be updated as well i don't need that in here aed courses this is like way back 1999 folks this stuff can just come right out too this has been on here since 1999 <laughs> wow i've never seen that before <laughs> Hey, this one is pretty cool. It says, um, Family Disaster Supplies Calendar is intended to help you prepare for disasters before they happen. You can assemble emergency kit in small steps over a six-month period. Check off each week as you gather the contents. One, week two, week three. Tells you what to do. Use it. Week five, week nine. Oh, we're going to have to dive more into this in the, another video. A house on our street was selling for 270 k Now, the same house sold for $1.8 million. So, from 270 to $1.8 I say that's really good. <laughs> that's crazy. We don't need those anymore. Obviously, California has changed. I know I have stuff behind this one as well. So, let's check it out. Uh, El Nino. What year was El Nino? I think it's safe to take this one down. I don't know why we're saving this. We don't need that. That's going to be the only one that's going to be on there because that's our Wi-Fi information for people who are here. So that's going to stay. 13, 14, 16. Is that right? And 17, lead crystal giftware. <clears throat> I think this was my mother-in-law's. Yeah, we don't have that anymore. So 17. A lot of this stuff was, hello, 1999. I mean, that's ridiculous. Why am I holding this stuff around? It's clutter, it's paper clutter, it's garbage, and it counts. So 17 items for the day 17. Goodbye. Much better. Uh, uh, yep. I am going to get rid of the following two of the Halloween bags two little halloween towels two halloween mitts string of lights a reflective halloween bracelet a spider web i've never used and this one here i used to always put this in my window it's a spider in a web yeah it's time to let that one go and then i have two skulls two light bulbs the black light bulb this cute little bean bag i've had him forever and then like this pail of a frankenstein and like a little witch's 
brew pot. And then this flimsy doesn't stay up. It's yeah, I don't really use it because of that. I'm gonna donate that as well. All right, so there we go. 18 items for day 18. Done. And um, so I'm gonna go ahead and count that one. <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of these. It has a little bunny rabbit in there and it's made out of egg. Isn't that cool? But it's cracked right there and it was in my formal dining room hutch for a long time. And yeah, I don't really need these. Same thing with this one. It's a decorative egg. It has an angel inside. I can let go of these. Another one, an egg really pretty i don't know i mean i don't really want these so maybe i can see if someone wants them online or something i really don't know <laughs> underneath my kitchen cabinet are you like me where like i don't want to toss this really good size jar there's really no need for me to keep these they're just taking up space in my below the kitchen cabinet so i'm gonna go ahead and get rid of those two i didn't find anything else i can get rid of underneath because i've decluttered so many times down there so i'm gonna check out one other cabinet let's see what i could find up there Okay, I'm gonna be completely honest. I dropped the ball and I gotta do days 19 and 20 together today. So that's 39 items, you guys. <laughs> this is hubby's. He would not want to depart with that. A mason jar that I am definitely gonna be using and keeping. These are two empty little jar containers. I really don't need those. Those can be just trash. And in there, I found my salad set. Jeez, I don't know if I even use this. Let's check it out. <laughs> uh, wow, I didn't even know I had this. But look, it's like tarnished. It's a oversized crystal bowl with silver plated rim. So will that come out? Oh my God, it's really heavy. Oh, it's gorgeous. I don't think I've ever used it, you guys. <laughs> oh, wow. Hmm, that is beautiful. But I have not used it probably because it's just been up in the cabinet. Okay, let me think about this. I like stuff like this. Crystal and all that. I need to look into how to... I guess you would polish that? I don't know. I'm not sure. If you do, let me know in the comments down below, okay? I'm going to put this in the back burner. I mean, hello, we still got one more week after this week, so... I'm going to think about this. This is a maybe. You know, it's so funny. I remember who gave this to me. It was my best friend's younger sister. I got this for my bridal shower. That was like, hello, 21 years ago. I mean, I used it. Of course, she's probably seen it in my vlogs. I'd rather have my bananas in a wooden bowl or something like that. It's just been taking up a lot of space lately. So I'm going to go ahead and depart with that banana holder thingy bajiggy. I also found these guys. Oh my gosh, she's... <laughs> we've had these forever um yeah there's four of those so i'm gonna go ahead and get rid of those i think it's also safe to toss these out and i need to find another place this is probably like my first apron i've ever had <laughs> i need to find a place to keep my aprons there's an old old one What's this one? I don't suffer from insanity. I enjoy every minute of it. <laughs> that is so funny, but I think I can let that one go too. Okay, I don't know what happened to the other part of this butter dish. <laughs> I think it's safe to also let that one go. And going through that shelf in there, I don't know what this went to as well. Hmm, yeah, I don't see anything. Maybe I should hold on to this just in case. Again, if I can't find it by next week, guess what? It's going to be part of next week. 
Okay, verdict, final decision that was made. This is nothing from my corning wear, anything else that I own. So I'm guessing I probably already tossed the bottom of it or e that it's broken. So I'm gonna go ahead and make that decision to let it go. And this lid, I don't know where this came from. I don't need it. So there we go. Okay, folks, so there we go. 19 items for day 19. Woohoo! Okay guys, this is all the stuff so far that I've been piling up and oh, <laughs> it's becoming to be a little bit too much. However, there is a couple of things that I could include with this whole thing that I started, I would say about a month ago. Okay, it's still the same day. I'm now on day 20, so I need to find 20 more items. I have a lot. I think the number thing is just messing with my mind because obviously it's not like the 30 bags in 30 days or the 30 day um, where you had a specific area or a specific room category to go through. The whole number is starting to affect of like, oh, but do I have 20 of those? You know, so it's kind of like one of those things. Like I said in the beginning, it's going to be random. Random decluttering. That means like if I pass something, <laughs> I pick something up. You know, one of those things. But I want to be brutal about this too. So I'm thinking a week, what is that going to be? Week four is going to be brutal. I have been working on a couple of decluttering little projects. Let me show you guys. I'm going to add this as item one for day 20. I'm going to add that in there. So that's one. If you guys follow my vlogs, you know that I've also decluttered this and this is an old recipe box and it's by Sutter Home. It's in really good condition. I've had this on now on Facebook Marketplace. It's been over a month on there and I'm just not getting any takers and I've been looking on eBay and they want this for like $40. $30 and I think I have it on marketplace for like 20 <laughs> so I don't know I don't know maybe I need to open it up a little bit where I can ship it out I mean it's in pristine condition it still even has the instructions that I found and that I included in there I'm gonna go ahead and add this because I'm gonna give myself a deadline so if I can't get rid of this in two weeks it's just gonna be donated that's item two Jay's gonna depart with two, three, four, five of these Coors Light batting bottles. I priced them out. I'm going to leave them on Facebook Marketplace for two weeks and we'll see where that takes me. So that's five plus two, that's seven. This is another item that he's going to depart with. This was his grandfather's. It's all the pipes and everything. So um, that's been on our entertainment center for like ever. I don't know. I got to figure out what to do with that. So that's item eight. We went up in the attic and we brought down this old antique cash register. So that's nine. And we also got one of these. And I think it's like the old antique first calculator. And we found a booklet on that. That makes 10. It's just been hanging up in our attic forever. Let's go up into the attic, see what else I can find. I need 10 more items. So how are you guys doing this whole decluttering minimalism game? Let me know in the comments down below if you are playing along with us. Make sure to check out the other fellow YouTubers who are participating in this collab. <sighs> yeah, it's, um, it's time to start getting brutal. But since this is my last day and I got a lot of editing to go, I'm just going to start randomly just getting things done so I can just end the day 20 here and then move on because <laughs> we have next week so make sure if you haven't subscribed make sure you click that subscribe button down there I think it's time for me to depart with all of these I've used these for so many years I mean they were great but yeah yeah 11 blue i mean i don't know what i can use that for i think this i had this for my husband's air force going away party when he was deployed so i'm gonna go ahead and depart with that too i'm debating on this but it's such a cute little hill i just might change the flowers i'm not too sure that's like a maybe 
These are always fun, uh, but I can go ahead and depart with two of those. I think it's safe for us to get rid of this. This is empty. I can get rid of that. That's just taking a lot of space up here. Here's another thing we don't need. <laughs> another bag. Another bag. 11, 12, 13. This is a Christmas drape. <laughs> don't need that that's 13 two sombreras that's 15 getting out of hand mountain here that makes it 16 great i lost count 17 and then 18 oh and then look i have two empty boxes just hanging out here so that makes it 20 20 items for the 20th day yeah it's piling up you guys it's piling up I'm going to depart with this crock pot recipe. I've tried to and mm, wasn't that impressed. This is our old, old stove we used to have, so I don't really need that. Uh, honey, I, yeah, I don't need that either. And I think I've already used what I needed from here. So I'm going to go ahead and depart with that too. Get rid of these. Remember these things? They zip over your, like, your bottle to keep them nice and cool. Yeah, we can get rid of those. I know Joe always grabs for that one. I'll leave him those. Can you say project? <laughs> I feel like I should be singing the Brady Bunch theme right about now. That needs to go in my Monica candle cabinet we went over last week. all of this stuff up there. Keep coupons. Let's see what the expiration date's on here. Oh, still good. 227.21. But we're not going to use this. February 23rd, 2020. <laughs> yeah, same thing. February 2020. Oh my god. That says 2017. I think it's safe to throw these out. <laughs> Four, five, six... Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21.